Lawmakers will take up a bill today that would put polling places inside of Davidson County jails, giving inmates easier access to voting. News Channel 5's Aaron Cantrell live from our state capitol this morning. And Aaron, not all inmates, though, would be able to cast their ballot if this becomes law, though, right? Right, Ben. So under Tennessee law, a felony conviction requires you to lose your right to vote. Now, you can earn that right back depending on what you're charged with. But this is, bill is for those folks who are behind bars and do not have a felony. And this will be a collaborative effort if it became law. And only a resident of Davidson County in custody at a county jail would be eligible to vote at one of these satellite voting locations. Now, the jail will be required to provide a voter registration application to any person in custody who request it in if they determine they're eligible to vote. They would also be required to make available resources containing information regarding the voting rights of a person with a criminal conviction in print and to pay for this money would come from the county to cover the expense of poll workers and for the equipment. Now they estimate the cost would be about $110,000 for two years and then the program would run until 2023.